Welcome everybody to another part of Sergeant Generation. This is part 10. We are now in the double digits. We are the semi finale, pre finale, whatever you want to call it, of this series. We are almost there, everybody. And yeah, welcome, welcome, everybody. I am. Ooh, I am excited. <laughs> uh, as much as I, I love this game though. Oh my gosh, bro. I know, I'm just gonna get excited when we get to the end of the series. And that means a new series about to come, and I hope. I don't know. I always try to improve myself every series, so I have new series because I'm like, this is gonna be better than the last. That's just my mentality. Anyway, so we just act one of Planet with. Yeah, so kind of doing a reversal on, like I said last part, it's a bit of a reversal of what we normally do because of how these, the last stage kind of is. I thought it'd be more fitting the other way. So, yeah. Anyway, so this Planet with, he uses Spike Power Up, as you can see on the screen right now. And we basically use that to go across the, um, whatchamacallit, the wall. Yes, the things that we are pop you're probably currently surrounded by, unless you're watching this outside, or in a pavilion. I don't know. But, yeah. So, Planet Wisp, again, it's from Sonic Colors, if you didn't see the last part. Yeah, it's, again, like I said last part, I like the game. It's not a horrible game or anything. It's not, like, my 100% like I have to play this all the time Sonic game. But it's definitely a fun time whenever I play it. I play it, I would say I probably play it once in a while, but... Yeah, it is some pretty good fun. That's obviously what this stage is based off of. So, yeah. Um. This is the last classic Sonic stage. I, I didn't even say that last part. That was the last modern Sonic stage. Because after this, we just got boss fights. This is the last time playing this classic Sonic ever, actually. Because. Yeah, next two boss fights are both modern Sonic. Which are actually in the spot. So, yeah. But. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I don't have too much about the Sonic Colors, which is kind of disappointing because it's also the longest stage, but... I don't know. Actually, I think of a fun fact. When I, the first time I saw a trail for Sonic Colors... It was such kind of funny. It was the first time I figured out what I heard about a Peggy. If you don't know what Peggy is, it's basically the ESRB. But for like European re regions, so I was like, "Well, what's a Peggy?" Cause it's, I think it begins like Peggy Seven. Kind of know how sometimes game to itself like wait E ten for everyone or whatever, or teen or M whatever. It's like I'm like, "What in the world is Peggy?" As I looked at, I was like, "Oh, neat." Yeah. So, uh, yeah, there's nothing too much. About this, I've always said last part. That's a part I kind of went on last part, but you know, actually, kind of fun fact about Sonic Colors. The original Sonic Colors was actually when the the script was written by the people who made Mad World, whatever that is. <laughs> uh, yeah, they were. Um... Oh wow, they announced this. Same year it came out. Let's see. Yeah, they announced it May 26th in a blog post. They announced it on a blog post. That's kind of neat, actually. That's wow. I don't know. I've never heard of them of a game being released on a blog post before. That's neat. But this game actually did get pretty good reviews. Basically, an average of eight out of ten, or an eighty out of a hundred, or. 4.5 stars out of 5. I'm trying to power such a super on the They actually rated it. Yeah, Nintendo Power gave it a 9 out of 10. Thing. That's cool. Yeah, uh. Basically, everything for this. Um. There's nothing too much else I have. Actually, the 3DS version of Sound Generation. They did. They didn't have this level. They had Tropical Resort, which is also kind of neat, huh? I never played three days more. It's something I would like to play one day, but I never have, unfortunately. It would be nice, though. Yeah, that seems to be it. All I really have about Sonic Colors for the most part. Yeah. 
But again, it's like I said, these stages are longer than your average stages in this game. Which, I don't know, I don't think anyone's ever... I don't know. It's a weird decision, I feel like. I can make this a final stage, but it doesn't feel like a final stage. Because, that's the only part I have a plan with. with. It just doesn't feel like a final stage. I can't... I don't know. Not a thing about this. There was... They did eventually do like this poll. Where they had a bunch of different Sonic games. And there's one just a game that I'll feature in here. It was like the different stages that was was going to would potentially be in this game. I think Marcy had... Yeah, they had stuff like Black Knight and... Not Se well, they had Secret Wings, but no one likes Secret Wings. I don't... I hate Secret Wings. Honestly, I don't like Secret Wings. I don't want to get into a tangent about Secret Wings, but no, Secret Sonic and the Secret Wings. I'm gonna say right now is the worst Sonic game I have ever played, <laughs> hands down. I know it's off topic, but I don't know when I'm going to get a chance to talk about this game. So I guess what I'm thinking about it, I will say is single. A hundred percent, I can say is the worst Sonic game I've ever played. Probably one of the worst games I've played in general. Worse than 06, or worse than Shadow, worse than this. Oh, I don't like it. It's like I don't know what really good comparison, but just it's not my cup of tea at all. Not even relatively close to it. It's more like my cup of my cup of of coarse poison apple from Snow White. That's what it is. Uh, weird analogies. That's definitely what you're here for. Anyways though, enough of me ranting about freaking Sonic and Secret Wings. No, no, but... The only thing I got Sonic and Secret Wings, but one of the my main... There's a lot only Sonic game I didn't have. At least... Well, yeah, at the time that I got it. It's only like me and Sonic game I didn't have. As I'm going to throw a question, I really thought I would like it because... I love Black Knight, and that's the sequel to it. I knew it wasn't the same like sword gameplay, but like it has to be somewhat similar controls. Nope. Like, I hope it's bad, but ugh. anyway, so oh, I actually love this final scene. I think it's yeah. Right here's like you see like you was you're, like you're like one and now you're escaping out of this place. Yeah, you see all the missiles just blast off, flying around in the background. It's amazing. I love that. Anyway, so we are done with Planet Wisp. That is amazing. No more stages for this playthrough. We are done. And we got that nice, perfect bonus at S Wink. Yeah. No one. I know I saw. I kind of see why Sonic used the S Wink. It's like Super Sonic or Sonic. But a lot of other games use the S. That's like the best Wink you get in the game. I don't understand that. Anyway, so boss battle time. Going go directly to it. And I want to say the first one's Silver. No, it's not the Robotnik. Do we do Silver's boss fight? I think we do. We should. Uh, no. Oh, we already did it, didn't we? Oh, we did. Never mind. My bad, we did already do it, I believe. I think. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. No, we didn't. Yeah, it's up ahead. Never mind. My B. My bad. Alright, but anyways, this is Dr. This is the Egg Dragoon. Basically, you're going to be... Yeah, that's what I'm going to try to tell us. Thank you, Omicha. Anyway. Okay, Omicha, thank you. Um. Basically, you're going to be chasing Dr. Eggman slash Robotnik. And you want to try to home attack his belly or his head thing. Actually, fun fact, I, I recorded this yesterday, this Eggman fight, because I don't know what happened to the original footage I had. But I just don't have it anymore. That's also why I don't have, the lives probably change out of nowhere. I, I don't know what happened to my original footage of this boss, so I'm like, where was that? I searched all around my computer, and I was like, well, guess it's time for me to re-record it. And of course, then I end up playing like half the stages in the game in the process, so. Yeah. That's kind of what happens at times, so. 
Anyway, so we are gonna continue through this fight. Oh yeah, right here you gotta use your little wall jump move, which I actually did not gonna do horrible on that part, I will say. But I actually did pretty good for once. <laughs> and yeah. I don't know, I just wanna see that. Yeah, you gotta drop yeah, dodge just a little freeze waves, gotta get on the ramp so you get up on the grind whales and flip between the whales or fall off like I did. So you know you could do that too, that's fine. Yeah. Perfectly fine. So yeah. Oh, there's really nothing else too much to say about this fight. I never actually went against the original version of this boss fight back in Sonic Unleashed, so I don't really have too much of a opinion about it, to be honest, but yeah. I don't know. I don't know what to say. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, sorry. Alright, so if you're hearing clicking, I'm just. Or well, hopefully, I'm trying not to make it too loud. There we go. Okay, I'll be done with clicking for now. Sorry, I just had a. Stu I hate stupid stuff pops up in my computer. Anyways, we should be about getting away to hit to the final. Yep, there it is. Alright. Basically, he's got to dash towards Dr. Eggman. You hold down, I think it's with the X button. You know, it's whatever the boost button is, so you just gotta kinda dash on down. I know, I did do the hard mode of all the bosses, and the hard mode of this boss is like, I think it's double the hits, and he also has a lot better aim in this section. It is pretty hard, actually. I actually try, I had to try to go and try and grab the wings, like they're flying around this area. Yeah. Supposed to finish him off in that section, but. Of course, gotta be special about it. and I finish him off right there. <laughs> we're not supposed to, because you see we'll drop down from a place we were just at. So yeah, kinda weird, but yeah, it's all good, it's all good. Anyways, we are gonna get, get more plot, because plot's good. <laughs> yes, that's very much good grammar. Anyways, uh, enjoy this cutscene. I can't believe this! I was supposed to beat you this time! Ah, I'm sorry. I didn't get that memo. I beat you every time! No, seriously. We beat this guy every time. It's like it's our job or something. What's Eggman even doing here? I thought you said he'd been kidnapped by that big weird thing that sent us all to this place. Alright, now it's time for our Silver Boss fight. And we'll be ending off the part of this. So, yeah. Anyways, here we go. So, once it loads up. Alright, anyways, here we go. So basically, Silver will be shooting his little car, his debris everywhere, and when he grabs a bunch of them like this, you want a home and attack onto the cars, which, it didn't hit me till later, it took me a bit, and now he's trying to throw them at me. Which I actually think it looks a bit cool, though. It'd be kind of cool if you had to do that, but, yeah, I think right there I could have home and attacked him. Right here, when he does this, basically, he's got to dodge it like so, and then, that's then he'll have this one move where he kind of brings a bunch of cars together and he'll like, yeah, like dash on through them. It's also this where he throws a bunch of different beams that are horizontal or vertical. And right here, yeah, nope, this is where we have to home attack again. Oh yeah, you hit any of the debris on the road, it gives you boost energy, so. Constantly ram into everything, just like City Escape. Gives you that good old boost energy. And there's a full set, I want to say it's like, 
three hits, and then the fourth one, there's like a final fourth one. Just like how most of these bosses have been, how there's like a final one where it's like the da 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 like the big epic one. So yeah. And most of the time, he'll just use cars to fire at you. I like this boss fight. I wish, I wish this was the one we got in 06. It's pretty cool, actually, but, you know. The boss fight, no, honestly, I don't think the boss fight in 06 is that bad. Like, people say it's bad. I think the Shadow one is bad, but not the Sonic one. You can also have Pyro Knowledge on it, so it's kind of unfair. I have Pyro Knowledge via the internet. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, then right here's a little move. I talk about how you had to dash through there. I know you have the boost there. If you don't boost, you don't get the... You're not able to get to him, I believe. Because you constantly move. You have to constantly boost him. So, yeah. I was I do like the music. I, bleh, the music. I don't really know what song it is. I'm pretty sure it's a remix. I may be wrong, though. It's pretty good, though. I do like it. So, yeah. Uh... Yeah, that's basically everything about the boss fight, I think. I wanna see why right here I went out of boost. I don't remember what happened. I wanna say I wanna say there was one point where I ran out of boost. Yeah, it was right there. Oh no yeah, you can't run across it. Never mind. I thought you had a boost. Yes, that now with that being a third hit, silver's gonna be crashing everywhere. Now the screen's gonna flip around. I'm trying to predict the future. And it's not working out well. No okay, it's four hits and it's the fifth one. We're gonna get this right eventually. I'll just keep going up a number. So whenever he like goes past, so he like teleport past or something. No, we hit him pretty hard. He's just like we're boosting. He's just rolling around. Yeah, here we go. For the final hit, you had to pass, go past this giant Katanami. Katanami Demoxe? I don't remember that. That's some Japanese game. I don't remember the name of it. Yeah, and now that I've ran out of boost, I. I'm screwed. I'll make it through, but, uh, yeah, we are getting awful close. I, yeah, I actually hit the thing. I hope I don't die. I don't, why, well, I, I thought I would have kept the footage I died in. Anyway, so that'll be the end of the part. Thank y'all so very much for watching. Silver just died from a horrible, horrible death. And, yeah, uh, I, Silver got sword. So, yeah, I will see you all in the next part. Bye!